Hey everyone, welcome to Shoreline. I'm gonna take you behind the scenes. I think what I really like about Shoreline is it feels like family. We love Shoreline! Woo! Shoreline's one of the most iconic and historic venues in the country. This is the house that Bill built. So we made sure that when we decorated backstage, we wanted little pieces of Bill back here to remind artists who made this place and to recognize their roots. Some of the greatest performers in the world have played here. I've seen more iconic performances at Shoreline than I can count. When you come into Shoreline, you know summer's here, you know you're gonna have a great time, you know the performers are gonna be on the top of their game, and there's just nothing like it. One of the first things that I wanted to show you was this iconic prop that Bill Graham used in a lot of his New Year's Eve shows. This is the Grateful Dead skull and roses image. It's one of the props that more artists pose near when they come to Shoreline and they take their own Instagram pictures at Shoreline. This is another cool feature that we just actually installed this year at Shoreline. We have our own herb garden that we use for all of our cooking backstage for tours. I don't know of any other venues that have this, at least in Northern California, so it's a, a great perk to have for artists when they're coming here on the road. Shoreline Amphitheater is a great venue. It's in the heart of Silicon Valley. They have great artists, great concerts, great performers that come. You can always run into somebody that you know, like my two yes. girlfriends that I just yes. see walking in. Yes. And we're out here with uh, to meet family and friends, and we are running into so many people, so that's one of the great things about Shoreline Amphitheater, and we love it here. Oh, we love coming to the Shoreline because uh, we could come out as a family, and it's a great place to bring the kids, and it's always good weather, beautiful people, good food, and good music. Most of all, the most important thing is we get to bring them with us, you know, and uh, be able to share this time with them, huh? So while Northern California might be known for wine, there are certainly a lot of people who love craft beer and cocktails. So we made sure we partnered with Fieldwork, 21st Amendment, Lagunitas, Golden Road, and a number of other breweries. And if you happen to love wine, we have everything from cake bread to flowers to vuv. When you come to Shoreline, we want the food here to be as diverse as the Bay Area. So we really try to bring in food for everybody when you come here, because when you're bringing 22,000 people to a concert, you never know what people's taste are. We brought in several celebrity chefs uh, from different, different genres. Danny Trejo, everybody knows Danny Trejo, actor extraordinaire. Fabio brought in some Italian for Fabio Vivani, top chef, Questlove. Everybody's familiar with Questlove and his work with The Roots. So we have the three taco plates from, from Trejo's. We do a mushroom taco, we do a carne asada taco, we do a pollo asada taco. Tortillas, the meat, the marinades, all of it are his specs. When it comes to the Fabio Viviani's ravioli, it's a marinara sauce, Parmesan cheese, parsley, and a fried pillow of goodness. Questlove is the impossible meat. It's the completely plant-based meat substitute. It's got a white queso. The relish is dill pickle and banana pepper, and it's in your traditional amoroso roll. We put a lot of time and effort into bringing more to the table than just your standard concert fare. We wanted to give fans a reason to come here and eat. So as a season ticket holder or a box seat holder, you've already got access to this great lounge. And the idea that folks can come in and enjoy themselves prior to a show, not have to fight traffic, not have to rush to get to a concert, was really the, the driving force behind the food and beverage operation and the concept of what we do. At the Mercedes-Benz VIP Terrace at Shoreline Amphitheater, we have a collection of spectacular wines, well-crafted whiskeys, rare whiskeys, and culinary options that will match every show. We buy what's freshest, we buy what's local, we buy what's available to us and what's in season and just really try to highlight what's best for the region, what's best for the time of year. We actually have wonderful dessert selections to finish out the evening. So with a whiskey, with a glass of champagne, we have chocolate covered strawberries. We work with Frost Cupcake Factory, who won Cupcake Wars. So you can end your evening on a sweet and wonderful note. I've been coming to Shoreline since it opened and usually hit half a dozen shows every year. This is our first year being part of the Terrace. We're really excited. We bring friends and clients to the venue here and the terrace has just been awesome to just socialize, relax after a day, and then enjoy the concert. The staff here is unbelievable. From the parking lot all the way through, you never feel like you're hustled or anything else. I like that experience because it feels good. And then all the way through the food and the show. We work in a business 
where we get to provide an escape for people. People spend their hard-earned money to come to a venue to have a good time, to forget about work, to forget about the problems that they're having. And the fact that we can be a part of that and make them smile when they come through a gate, that's, that, that's worth anything in the world. Now is the perfect time to experience Shoreline Amphitheater. For the full schedule and ticket information, visit livenation.com.